Hello everybody, I'm Happy Bacon 777 and welcome back to War Thunder. Today we are continuing the 5 games only challenge and we are starting this challenge off today with a tank that I always have fun with, the Storm Tiger, or however you say it. As you can see, the RP in Silver Lines gains are 368 and 410 respectively. Like I said before, let's just hop straight into these 5 games and I'll pretty much just cut out all the monotonous buildup and lead straight into the battle and the destruction of either myself or the enemy team. Let's go. Match number one, we are at Tunisia, and it seems like we are at uh, an up tier, but it should be no problem with a tank like this. Let's see how it goes. I swear this thing always undershoots. That's disappointing. Oh man, unfortunately it seems like I made them all go into hiding. Not this guy. Bam, right on top. Gotta love it. Hello brother. We shall win this. Hello, and goodbye. This might be it for us. Gotta try harder than that, buddy. Ooh, let's see if I can get him. Oh, I only got his cannon barrel? Yeah, that's probably from the water. Get it? There we go. That's what I like to see. Well, that didn't go as planned. All right, let's roll right into the next one. And at match number two, we are at the winter version of the Ardennes. It seems we're at an up tier again, but you know what? We're just gonna have to take that and let's just see how it goes. Yeah, this tank definitely gives you a good workout on your mouse wheel. Ah, oh, yeah, that's what you get for not checking both of your corners. Dang. All right, match number three, Sansa Sinai, and we are on a down tier. So let's see how it goes. Maybe. Oh man, we're gonna try that again. All right, let's see if we can get it. No! Oh man, I swear this gun is a lottery. Every single time you shoot, it's either over or under. All right, let's see. Nah, he's going too fast. Darn. All right, let's see. I swear I'm getting closer and closer to these guys. Ooh, got Mr. Hellcat over here though. Bye-bye. Oh 
no, I got out high explosived. Damn it. Okay, well, let's get into the next one. All right, number four, I gotta be honest, fellas, this ain't going so well. I mean, we're on Carpathia, average uh, tier, I guess, not down tier or up tier. Uh, let's just see how it goes. Nope, I'm gonna keep on going. Oh, poor M26. All right, maybe. Nice. I mean, of course I'm going to try that again. Oh, beautiful. It's like a money printer right here. Oh, that was brutal. All right, for a final match, we are back on our dens, but not in the winter. We are about average for our battle rating, and let's see how it goes. Ah, oh, just barely missed. Oh yeah, I see you, buddy. Nice. Point blank. You almost feel bad for him. Hello. Goodbye. Oh, no. Oh, that was a close one. Oh yeah, I'm gonna scare the shit out of them. <laughs> well, that works. Goodbye. Oh, slowly turn around. Oh, that was close. See? No, I'm always bad at moving targets. Oh, he sees me. Oh, yeah, he sees me. Angle. There we go. Oh. Move the cannon barrel away. Just stay at an angle. Oh, it is close. I'll preset to 100 if I can. There we go. That's how you do it. All right, and that, folks, was the Sturm Tiger for a play for five games straight. You can see the results rolling on by right now. With I averaged about the activity, the silver, and the RP gains. Honestly, this tank is a whole lot of fun, but it suffers a lot from its usability. It does have some fun moments, 
and the armor is very fantastic, but it is very hard and is sometimes, well, to use this gun, and it's sometimes, uh, it, it can work against you. So with that being said, I'll rate it about six bacon strips out of 10. And finally, as always, thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, feel free to subscribe for more similar content, and I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye.